we should probably go ahead and get started. Um, are we all here? Yeah, looks like it. Um, Larry, if you want to let me know when we're live. Health order and the governor's executive order N 2920. This meeting is not physically open to the public. Council and staff are meeting via Zoom, and there are several ways for the public to watch and participate. Information on how to join the meeting over Zoom or with your phone is available on our website, cityofcapitola.org, on the slides shown, and on the published meeting agenda. Thank you for attending this special city council meeting. Mayor Peterson, back to you. Thank you. Uh, can we have a roll call, please? Yes. Councilmember Bertrand. Here. Councilmember Botworth. Here. Councilmember Story. Here. Vice Mayor Brooks. Here. Mayor Peterson. Here. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll now do the Pledge of Allegiance. I will ask all the council members to mute themselves except uh, let's see. How about Councilmember Bertrand? Will you lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag, the United States of America. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't ready for this one. The United States of America. Oh boy. No. And to the Republic. Probably for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, and with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Councilmember Bertrand. Uh, we are going to move on now uh, to see, is there any additional materials for today's agenda? No, there were none. Great, thank you. Are there any additions or deletions to the agenda? Not that no changes. Okay, we'll turn it over now to public comment. Uh, are there any members of the public that would like to address the council on any items uh, not on today's agenda? Mayor Peterson, I do not see anyone uh, in attendance through Zoom, and I do not see any emails. All right. Uh, with that, we'll move on to our only item on general government for today's agenda. Consider a resolution designating agents for disaster assistance with the State Office of Emergency Services and repealing resolution number 48. Turn it over to staff. Thank you, Mayor Peterson. Uh, good afternoon, Mayor and Council. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. Um, this will be relatively quick. So this, uh, this is the week that we need to apply for our reimbursement for costs related to our mutual aid response on the CD lightning fire. I learned this week on Monday that there's a resolution that we need to pass that designates um, the agents of the city in order to submit that resolution. We've done the same resolution two other times, the first in 2011, second for the uh, storm drain. And then the second time was for Park Avenue, uh, storm damage along the road. That 2017 resolution actually expired June 8th of this year. I contacted State Hallelujah and they would not accept that one with an update from November 12th, which is why we are here this afternoon. So um, everything is ready to go for the reimbursement, except for this resolution. And like I said, this is basically the same resolution designating city manager public works director and the finance director as agents for the city to um, file reimbursement claims. And with that, I would be happy to take any questions. All right, any questions from council on this item? Seeing none, we'll turn it over for public comment. Any comments from the public on this item? I do not see any attendees and I do not see any email here, Pearson. Okay, Let's bring it back to council for uh, deliberation and vote. Motion to approve the resolution. Second. We have a motion by Councilmember Bothorff and a second by Councilmember Bertrand. Can we have a roll call vote, please? Yes, Councilmember Bertrand. I agree. Councilmember Bothorff. Aye. Councilmember Story. Aye. Vice Mayor Brooks. Aye. 
Mayor Peterson. Aye. Great, motion carries unanimously. Wonderful. Well, that was a fantastic five-minute meeting.